can't see real Luke anywhere. I guess that means Jimmy is the star of the show. This video is all about you. What are the changes that you've made to see the day? Um, the main changes. Last week we moved the stone wall from there to the back. Um, switched them all at the round just to give us a longer run. Now we got a ten foot, full 10 meter run indoors so we don't have to go outside in the rain. And yeah, it's just a lot more spacious now. Yeah, we're rolling. So we have, for overhead pressing we have five different logs. We have four in the rack here. We also have three different axles, two in the rack. And then here, this is where we normally do our pressing. This is a big boy log. It is we going heavy. How heavy is that? That's 67 and a half kilos empty. Full, it's a spec 12 inch log. And as you can see, we've got a 40 kilo solid axle at the back and the floor there. Now we're moving to the power lift area. 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 So we have monolith. We have monolith. We have two different squat bars. We have a strength strap, 25 kilo squat bar, eight foot long. Now we have AOA, all athletics, eight foot squat bar. 25 kilos. We also have hammered bar and safety spot bar. To use on there, we have strength shop competition plates. I can almost see it. This is a comp spec bench from all athletics. With big boy weights on. Big boy weights on. You're responsible for that. I, I can't press this, so it's definitely not me using that. <laughs> this is a strength shop bastard bar, power bar that's been used on here now. As well as the strength shop power bar, we have a Texas power bar, um, another strength shop power bar, and three all athletics power bars. Easy. This is like a bodybuilding area, basically. We have a lap pull down, very heavy duty, cable roll at the back, steel roll from Strength Shop, and 45 degree hyperextension leg press. Press we have some big wagon wheels used for high height pulls and deadlift or overhead the axle and we have a sneaky 102 kilo dumbbell height in there as well what are the dumbbells you have um, as well as that we also have a 45 kilo um, loadable dumbbell 25 kilo loadable dumbbell we have got another 40 kilo one that's out on loan at the moment probably going back soon in the strongman area we have full five stone stone run from 60 inches down to 48 we have 11 stones ranging from 50 kilos to 180. And as well as that, we have three super yokes. We have one that's 60 kilos empty, one that's 100 kilos empty, and this big boy, which is 180 kilos that we weight on it. Then we have three sets of farmers. We have two normal light sets. And then we have a big gear of farmers, which is 70 kilos each. We also have a load of a crucifel stone. Um, a stray football bar sitting in the corner yeah. there. Um, oh, was, oh, we also, I forgot about that, we have that big block. Oh, the block, yeah. Well. That never gets moved. This thing. And that is a horrible, horrible piece of kit called Duck Walk. Never ever use it because your legs will hurt. <laughs> We also have an inversion table in the corner. If you've never used one, it basically just helps to decompress your spine. So after heavy yokes, squats, if you're feeling a bit stiff, jump on one of them for a few minutes. Definitely helps. And the last piece of strongman kit we've got is the Viking press and the sandbags. So yeah, lots of sandbags. Lots of sandbags. We have about 10 sandbags going from 40 kilos up to 160. As well as that, we have two throwing sandbags and throwing events. Uh, we also have loads of blocks for block poles, jerk blocks for jerking you know, or loading on to. And yeah. More sandbags. And more sandbags over there. They mostly they don't really move though. You there we go. <laughs> this is Ethan's favourite section. They have a full range of grippers, Captain the Crash, um, RB and Dodger Grip. 
And well, within that box we have uh, Rolling Thunder from Strength Crop, as well as wrist rollers. And yeah, I think that's it. Yeah. Can't forget the trophies. Yes. This is a trophy shop. Mostly Rihanna's trophies. <laughs> I, I was allowed to have one shelf. Oh, and a little one there. It's, uh, mostly Rihanna's. Rihanna told me the codes to finding out if they're your trophies or Rhys. If they're first place, it's the Rihanna. <laughs> That's what she said. If they're second or third, they're probably mine. As you can see, mine are mostly silver and bronze. I've got one gold trophy there. Oh, well. At least you're an honest man. Mine's the biggest, though. Where? Oh. I think I will beg to differ. Uh. I think that one's bigger. <laughs>